Hey guys, I know what you guys are thinking. Um, this video has been long overdue. It's been, it was first requested um, like in December and now it's in March. I know it's totally my fault. Um, I just couldn't get it right by doing this video. I know it's such a simple video, but um, it just mm, hasn't been that simple along the process. I first got these questions in December. And I tried recording um, this video right like a week afterwards or something um, and I watched the video but it just wasn't up to par um, I felt like it could have been better somehow it just it just wasn't what I I liked I guess and I mean it was simple it's a simple video but I just didn't like it um, so I, I just wanted to re-record it but then I kept getting pushed back it kept getting pushed back because I, you know, I had finals that time and then I was on um, on break. But then during break, it was pretty busy. Um, I was busy relaxing, but then I was also busy with family and everything. <sighs> yeah, all of them are excuses, but just being real with you guys, it's really, you know, I'm just busy and I couldn't really get down um, and just sit here and just talk to you guys. So I got back home from school and I am very determined to knock this video out for you guys. I normally just show them a picture. I think it's so awesome if you bring in a picture of what you want your hair to be because that picture will help so much. You know, I feel like as an artist, um, having visuals is like the easiest thing because people just aren't best at explaining things and maybe the one when you explain it one way they might take it another way so I think the picture is just straight to the point they'll know what you're talking about um, especially if you want your hair highlighted or anything and the way you want it cut that is just the way to go my hair uh, the Frankie Sanford hair I showed her pictures of Frankie and I showed it from every uh, angle if you want those pictures I'll post it down in the description box also so you can use it if you wanted to get this haircut and then the haircut where both sides were um, shaved and then it's like really short right here. Um, I can also post that picture down below. My sides and the back from when I first trim it, it would be like two weeks later. You can see it kind of growing out already. Um, but I always wait till a month or a little after a month to trim it because you know, it adds up when you go to the hair salon all the time. I mean, I have a friend that works at the hair salon, but you know, I still have to pay for it. I mean, I get a discounted price, but still, like, it still adds up. Um, right now, I didn't trim it because I am growing it out into a bob, and I'm almost there. I'm so happy. Um, but yeah, I am not going to have this hair anymore. But yeah, um, but when I do trim it, I tr try to go like a month or five weeks. That's usually how long I can go for um, before it gets kind of rough and stuff. Um, but yeah, if you want to keep it short, you really have to be consistent with the trims. Yeah, you can do um, a few different styles. If you have the legit Frankie hair where it's like a whole bob on the side, the only thing that you can really do is do a little braid possibly. Um, or just curl it that is a little bit more limited towards that style because um, both of your sides are uneven so you can't really do um, different types of hairstyle but if you have the hairstyle where it's like shaved alright guys um, my good camera the, the Canon camera actually ran out of batteries just when I was like ending um, I think question two or three um, so we're just gonna switch gears a bit and go with the webcam because that's the only last resort I have. <laughs> I'm going to try to finish off my last question which was about the different hairstyles. Um, I think I only got caught, cut off at like the part where I said you can do um, a lot of different hairstyles if you have both sides shaved um, because then you know they're both even. But yeah, like I said, um, you just have to kind of practice, play around with it, and you'll figure out a lot of different hairstyles that would work good for you. Um, the work, work good for you. 
work well for you, whatever. I just can't, I'm just, my mind is so boggled right now, so I'm so sorry if I'm like just, mm, my words are a little jumbled. Um, but yeah, you get the deal, right? First of all, if you want to go short, go for it because I feel like hair is just hair. It'll grow back regardless and if you really, really hate it, you could totally go for hair extensions, you know. Nowadays, there's so many things that you can do to your hair that it's temporary but at the same time it's instant. So there's, there's bound to be a way to fix it if you don't like it. Um, but if I had to go a little bit deeper into it, there are two types of people someone that wants to get their hair cut short but is very hesitant and there's the other type of person that just wants to get it short and they'll go for it. If you're the type to just want to go for it, you do your thing, you know. I love short hair on girls and I think they are, I don't know, it's just something about it that just gives them an edge and I truly, truly love it. I really wish I could see more girls with short hair but if you love short hair and you want to try, go for it. Um, I don't think it could steer you wrong as long as you talk to you know your hairstylist and they know how to frame your face I think you can't go wrong with that for the girls um, who are a bit hesitant I feel like you should kind of just get um, opinions from other people that are really close to you like truthful opinions they might say that it won't look on you they might say that it looks amazing on you but um, I only say to ask people it's because it's kind of easier just to hear what other people will say but in the end it's always going to be your decision because when I wanted to cut my hair short I did ask a lot of people first um, to see what their opinions were and a lot of them said don't get it because you know girls should have long hair which is totally false um, but in the end I still went for it because I was like screw it I want short hair I want to try it but yeah, I'm just saying to ask people is just because because you'll actually um, go for what they're saying or you'll oppose to it. So I feel like asking for other people's kind of opinions would help you steer yourself into what decision that you want. So I hope you guys um, get some advice or if you're looking to get short hair, you kind of get a little bit of a reference and all that. If you have any further questions, please just feel free to like... Um, Instagram me, message me, tweet me. Um, I will reply back. Um, it's just easier on social media sometimes. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will see you guys in my next video. Alright, bye.